Right, so apologies no gi, it's trading this morning, it's red up. So we're gonna look at a Korean group. So obviously like this is a judo kit, so I can get a load of that sleeve in my hand, I can control the sleeve. But you see jujitsu kits are real small, sometimes really hard to get a sleeve grip like this. Yeah, so if you can't get a sleeve grip, this Korean grip's a really good I I use this as a go-to. So it's like a really go, good go-to grip that controls his neck and his shoulders and you don't need the sleeve at all. So if you're right-handed and normally you take a right hand on the lapel, left hand on the sleeve, this time you take a left hand on the collar. When you take the left hand on the collar, you need your knuckles in line with his collarbone. So this hand should control the top of his shoulders. If I can control his shoulders, that's how I can break his posture and that's how I can take him down. I'm going to get this left arm and I'm going to put it down into his collar and the knuckles are in line with his collarbone. Then my strong arm from the right side is going to come all the way around the back of the neck and I'm just going to put my thumb inside the collar here. So like, there's about five centimetres in between my two thumbs touching. Okay? So my thumb is on that bone on the back of his neck and my left arm, I've got my thumb inside and I've got my thumb in line with his collarbone. Yeah, so now I've completely control his head. The last thing I'm going to do is pinch my elbows. So I bring my elbows in. So I'm not taking the grip and squeezing. I take the grip and I just pinch my elbows in. Yeah, so that is the Korean grip. And we're going to work up some twitches from here and some takedowns to grapple or Jiu Jitsu. i do it from this angle. From here, I'm going to go collar, left hand. See, what I'm not doing is switching my stance. I'm right handed. I've got a right foot forward still. I'm going left hand collar instead of the sleeve, in line with his collarbone. Right hand, thumb in the back of the neck. I'm going to pinch my elbows here. There's no squeeze of the biceps, my arms are relaxed. And he's pinching my elbows and using the weight on the back of his neck to break his posture. That's the grip.